Hey everyone, it's Livefly94. So this is strictly going to be on the iPod control and the music setting controls on the DNX5160. So first off, I'll go on the control of the iPod. So this is on my iPod right now, as you can see. To get to that on the DNX5160, you simply will just go to the SRC, which is all the menus. Then you click on the iPod, and it'll bring you to the screen. So, while you're on the screen, you can uh, either press music, which will bring you to the playlist, the songs, the albums, everything you can choose from. Um, to get back to the main screen, you just press control again. And uh, there's also video and all that stuff if you have a video player on it. Um, so as these main buttons, of course, are pause, play, next song, and fast forward. And to get back to the list of like songs, instead of pressing music, you can just uh, go back to where you were. And let's say you want to go to your songs, uh, you know, you, you can go through that by just clicking the arrow, or you can use the scroll bar, or if you have a remote, you can use that. That doesn't come with it. Then on the left here, to get out of the songs menu, you can just press the up button, and it'll bring you back. Then you can go to playlists, and you can go there, and the top just brings you back to this menu, if you're in a few different menus. So, as you can see, it's pretty sweet to use. There's, uh, you can just simply go to the playlist and then find it that way and scroll through all the songs in there. As some of these, you actually have to control it by just pressing fast forward. You can actually go to all the, uh, songs and playlists, so that's really sweet. Um, so yeah. Now, for music settings and everything, it's, uh, sorry. Pretty much, it'll come like that, so you'll see that little arrow up there. Uh, you just want to press that. Then these three objects will come out. The right one will just bring you to this screen. The middle one is going to be like your, all your, where you can spe uh, specifically uh, set your settings. So your frequencies and everything. Yeah. So you know, it's got uh, some really fine tuning on it, which is sweet. And then uh, on your very left one, this is going to be all your tools. So you know, not just for the sound itself, but for the display and all that. Now, um, another way to get to the sound, I guess, if you're, uh, say you're on the map or whatever, then you can just press the bottom bar there and it'll bring you back and to get to the navigation you just press the bottom bar again so yeah it's pretty sweet to use um, really easy and it's really uh, specific so you can do a lot of stuff with it uh, there's info so that tells you the title artist and uh, you know you can set whatever to say in those and uh, yeah so if you have any audiobooks, composers, if you want to check out the Jenners, all that stuff's there. So they didn't really leave anything out at all, and it's really easy to use. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that uh, little information video. If you want another video on anything else that's included with it, like the navigation, feel free to let me know, and I can do that for you. Alright, have a good day everybody.